Grace's room. So I'm in London at the moment. I made it here after a 24 hour flight. It was so long. So I had a bit of a sleep. I'm feeling much more rested now and I'm ready to start doing some sightseeing. It is the morning. So that means I do need breakfast. So I'm very hungry and we're gonna go get some breakfast now. So let's go. Um, so we're walking to breakfast and it doesn't really seem like it's like the most nicest day today. It's quite wet and cold so hopefully it clears up later on because I don't really want to be staying in the cold. So my breakfast just arrived. I got Nutella pancakes. As you guys know I love Nutella and it's a very nice healthy start to the day. Since we're here in London, we thought that it would be cool if we saw um, a show at the theatre. So we were not really sure what to see though. There's Aladdin, which I've already seen. There's, um, there's Wicked, there's The Lion King. But I think we're probably going to go see Wicked because um, it sounds like it's going to be really like a good show. So we're going to go get our tickets now. We've got our tickets and we're going to go see Wicked tomorrow night. So right outside our hotel, they're having the premiere for the Toy Story 4 um, movie and it actually looks like so cool, like there's so many screens, like a red carpet here. I've heard that apparently some of the cast is going to be here, like Tom Hanks. I really wish I was invited. So we're walking around Piccadilly Circus at the moment. Um, it looks really pretty. Um, so we're trying to find Oxford Street so we can do a bit of shopping because you guys know I love shopping myself. Um, if I heard it's apparently a really big street. My mum and dad have been here before so like they've been there and stuff. So I'm hoping I can do a little bit of shopping and stuff. I've heard of, like the Selfridges there and I really want to go there so yeah. So we're walking on Regent Street at the moment. It kind of reminds me a bit of Monopoly. Uh, so it's a really pretty street. It's like really long as well. How cool is this Alexander McQueen store? Now it's time to do a bit of shopping. So we finally made it to Selfridges, the store I've been waiting to go to. Um, they have a lot of really nice brands there, cough cough makeup. So I really want to go in inside and check it out and hopefully do a bit of shopping. Of course, we couldn't leave here with 
they're getting some Godiva um, chocolate, the strawberries. James loves those, that's his favorite. I might have one myself. <laughs> I have a few things here. So let's see how they look. So the first thing I tried on is this white top. I think it actually looks really nice. It's like very cute and smooth or something like that. I actually really like this one. So I have this top on from Tommy Jean. It's very bright. I love the like fabric. It's like velvety. I'm not sure about this one. It's not too bad. But Guys, I love this jumper. It's also from Tommy Jeans. It's so cozy and comfortable. It looks really nice too. So yeah, it might be good for the cold weather back in Melbourne. But guys, I'm trying on these t-shirts and it's messing up my hair like so much. <laughs> so I have this romper. This is really cute. It's got like flowers on it. It's actually so pretty. I know it looks a bit short, but like it's actually not like that short, but um, it's really nice actually. I think this might be like nice like summery thing to wear so i actually really like this one so this is the last thing i have to try on it's honestly probably one of my favorite things i've tried on it's so pretty it's from fila or villa however you guys say it um and it's like a dress um and like with like a top underneath it it's so pretty i actually really like it oh, there's so many mirrors <laughs> Yeah, so what do you guys think? I actually really like this one. It's just a little bit small, so I might have to get a bigger size. So we are at Carluccio at the moment. We decided to have a bit of a stop from all the shopping and have some lunch. So I have some spaghetti with some uh, prawns at the moment, and I'm really excited to eat it because I am starving. So guys, I ordered a meringue and look at the size of it. It's almost the size of my head. <laughs> Mate, Jane, it's probably the size of your head. <laughs> kind of. Um, well, I mean, it looks really good, so I can't wait to try it. I'm not going to take a big bite out of it because my family wants some too soon. Mm, yum. Oh, wow. <laughs> So guys, we are currently on a hop-on, hop-off bus at the moment in London. Um, we're going to go see a few different sites, maybe get off and see a few things. So I am quite excited. It is a bit windy though. Very windy. So my head's going to fly off. Top of 
the London Eye at the moment. We can see all of London. It looks really pretty. Buckingham Palace over there. It looks really cool. London Eye and um, we saw some really nice views up there. It looked really good. Um, so now we're gonna hop back on the bus and go see a little bit more of London. London. Um, it's a thousand year old castle that was built to protect the crown jewels. Um, it's very, very big um, and I'm excited to go in and just learn about some of the history and stuff. Um, Queen Anne was beheaded. Um, I'm not sure why she was beheaded, but I'm going to find out now. So don't mind my hair flying everywhere. I mean, it's really windy at the moment, so just have to ignore that. But we just saw the torture devices and we saw like the ways that like people with the prisoners were tortured and stuff. And although it was pretty like creepy and like gross the way they tortured like people, it was actually kind of interesting like seeing all the stories and stuff. I mean, I can't believe they used to do that back then. All right, we're gonna keep on looking. Um, there's like this tower over there we wanna try and get inside of and see what's in there, so yeah. London, it's time to treat myself a little 
bit so I have my apple pie here and oh no an apple tart and I am really excited because I'm really hungry. Wow guys, so I walked past this store, I've never heard of it, it's called Boots um, and basically it's just got like all these beauty stores, it's like a huge Sephora, they have so many brands and obviously I can't walk past a makeup store without going in. So I'm at the Clarence stand right now and I'm just watching all these lip glosses and it's really going to be hard to not buy something. So. <laughs> so pretty. They even have Fenty Beauty here. I was so surprised. Like I don't, can't believe I've never heard of this store. Okay. This is definitely my store. morning when I went to Oxford Street because I did get a few things so I definitely got my shopping fix for London um so firstly I went to Zara and I got a few things from here I got this really nice top it's like a singlet top I think the straps can come off as well here it is um I got two skirts as well this really nice one it's like shorts underneath and then it's like got like this it hide on top so this is really nice it's like a black and white polka dotted one and then I have this sunflower one but this one is so cute I think it'll look nice with like a white top or something it'll be very nice hopefully when I go away someplace um, in Europe um, so then I went to Adidas or Adidas some of you might call it <laughs> Um, I got this really nice top. At first I saw it, I was like, oh, I'm not too sure, but I tried it on and it actually looked really nice. So, this. And then here is this long sleeve three stripes top. I thought this one might be nice to wear here in London because it is a little bit cold at the moment. And then the last thing I got, it's this um, bodysuit so you can wear, wear it with like shorts on top. Thought it was really nice. Um, and then I went to Urban Outfitters. Actually, no way, I'll show you this. So I got one, I went to Primark, and I'll be honest, I was a little bit underwhelmed. Like, I thought there was gonna be like a lot more things. Like, it was a really big store. I mean, like, it was nice. So I found this top, it's almost like a tennis top, but it was actually really nice. And like, they had like some good prices as well there, so that was good. Um, and I got two Selfridges, this is so cool, I loved that, um, that there. Um, uh, I got this, like, lip kit from Huda Beauty. All these things I got was from Huda Beauty, I love that, um, brand so much. So it is a lip kit and it has two mini, a lipstick, a mini lipstick, a mini lip gloss, and then a full-size lip liner. It's so pretty, how pretty is that lip gloss? Um, and then I got these three liquid eyeshadows. So I, I know I know the green's a little bit um very bright, probably not something you'd usually wear, but I thought these would look so, these look so like pretty together. I love these colours, so I had to grab them. <laughs> and then the last door 
Oz Urban Outfitters. I definitely got quite a few things from here. It was I love Urban Outfitters so much. I got this Tommy jeans jumper. This is so warm and cozy when I tried it on. Um, I got this dress <clears throat> from Fila. I'm not sure how you say it, Fila, Fila. Um, but it looks like really nice with this white long sleeve top underneath it. Um, it's also from Fila as well. And then this top, it says like Luna or something on it. It's like just a nice sort of cropped shirt. And then the last thing is this um, romper or jumpsuit. This one's really nice. It looks really nice on. It might be nice to like go out like or you know when I go out or something like that. So that was everything that I got. I know I got quite a few things but like I said that's probably all the shopping I'll be doing here in London. Um, so we are going to rest for a little bit um, now and we're probably going to go find some dinner after because we're still a little bit tired and quite full from all that afternoon tea and stuff. So in Hawaii, there's an ABC store in every corner. Um, in, a, in the USA, there's a Starbucks in every corner. And in London, it seems to be that there's a Presa Manje, however you say it, in every corner. Because we're always walking through the streets and one of these stores pop up. So we're having dinner now, not surprising. We're having food again. Um, I have margarita pizza here. James also has margarita pizza. Um, and I'm very hungry at the moment, so I'm gonna start eating now. I need to cut it up. So, I just finished dinner, guys. I am actually so tired. I can't wait for my head to hit my pillow. I am. It's been a really long day in London, so I hope you guys enjoyed this day in London, and I guess I'll see you guys the next time at Grace's room. Bye for now.